Use star code GAMERGIRL whenever you're buying Roblox or Roblox Premium. Also check out my UGC and real life merch which is linked below in the description. Thank you! Hello gamers! Today we are going to be looking at some Royal High leaks about the new school as well as some new hairstyles possibly coming to Royal High. But before you get started, just a reminder to use Starco Gamer Girl whenever you're buying Robux or Roblox Premium. It's really really simple to do, all you have to do is scroll down and find the box where it says in Star Code and then enter Starco Gamer Girl and press add. It's as simple as that. Also make sure you follow me on social media. My Twitter handle is Amigamiguri, my Instagram handle is Amigamigirl underscore, and my Roblox username is Amigamiguri. But Samigame Girl with the L and I switched. And so I have already made a few videos showing you guys some of the cafeteria. I will link those videos in the description below so that you guys can go and check them out. But you know how it's gonna be some like food and stuff that you're able to get in there and then you're able to like eat in the cafeteria itself. But it turns out there's actually more to the cafeteria than we originally thought there was going to be and so night barbie has made a tweet after like i don't even know how many months three four months or something and so it says blueberry muffin a freshly baked muffin that melts in your mouth made from organic blueberries gourmet flour creamy butter and sprinkled with sweet sugar crystals the most important ingredient of all pastry chef ashes love written by kate cart 22 cafeteria almost done and then you can see the a little bakery gif that's so cute and so yeah it seems like there's going to be descriptions for the food i'm kind of wondering how that's going to work like is it maybe going to be like you're ordering on a menu and then you see all the different items they have a little description to go alongside of it or it may be going to have butlers and like when you tap on them it has these descriptions you know like maybe you go and tap on ash and then it'll say a freshly baked muffin and like all of that stuff you can see in the description i'm kind of wondering how this is all going to work i think it's really really cool it sounds like we could maybe be getting butlers which is really 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 exciting i am just going to go and check quickly that there's no other tweets i don't believe there are any but i could be wrong no there aren't <laughs> okay then let's just go over to the next tweet that we have to show and so if we go over here to this tweet that was made by Salty Shio you can see it says Hatsune Miku hair the pigtails took me so long to make but I think it was worth it faced by the talented Shimizu slaps this is kind of like a mini collab lol no no new set and so if we go and look at this you can see this hairstyle it looks so cute like I love this so much especially like the, I don't know what it's called, render? I think that's what it's called. Like, it looks so cool. I really, really love this hairstyle. And yeah, you can see it does have like some little hair accessories as well, which is nice. And then if you go and scroll down, you can see Soul to Shoot said, Yes, the hair is made for a high. And yes, these hairs aren't cancelled and should hopefully get in game anytime soon. Waiting for Barbie to reply. And if you go and look at it, you can see all of the new hairs that Soul to Shoot has made. Except they're all blurred, so you can't actually see any of them. <laughs> I mean, you can see them slightly, you know. But you can see some of them are long and stuff. You can kind of tell by the different colours where there's different hairstyles. <laughs> I mean, you can't really see them properly, but they're still there you know <laughs> it, it's the thought that counts okay but anyways if we go over to the next tweet now over here that was made by if we wait a few seconds david is cool it says here's another look at the sky map for future battle ella royal update inside of royal high what do you think of it and so we have already seen the sky map a little bit but now we're looking at it a little bit more and so you can see this is pathway over here and then you can see the two separate islands that i already showed a bit oh those hot air balloons i wonder if you're able to fly them probably not but i think that'd be cool like imagine if you could just fly over real high like with the hot air balloon that would be so cool for like photos and stuff i would love that but anyways if you go and look at the last tweet over here that was made by sticks and tricks it says since we last seen it to heart has finished the starter set of dawn furniture more in the thread below and so if you go and look at this you can see some of the different items of furniture here you can see i think this is fire furniture if i'm correct you can see there's like some beds and some other random and some other miscellaneous pieces of furniture and stuff 
And then if you go and look at the next photo, you can see this is clearly water themed, judging by the jellyfish and like the seashells and stuff. <laughs> it's quite clear the theme for that one. And then if you go and look at this, you can see the dark furniture. Oh, this looks so cute. I love the stars. The stars are so nice. And then you can see the light furniture over here. And so I'm not 100% sure if this furniture is going to be customizable or not. Maybe it will be. I'd love it to be, but maybe it won't be. Well, we won't know until the actual school comes out. But the fact that the cafeteria is almost ready and like Night Barbie has made the first tweet in like three months or something, it's definitely a good sign that the school's like getting there. I'm not gonna say almost done because it could still be very far away, but you know, it is getting there, okay? But anyway, so we can look at this next tweet over here. It says, also the well again from the library area, I think. I haven't seen the inside of the library area. I'm a little bit behind on that. I definitely need to catch up with my little Royal High Tea videos. But here you can see some more of the light furniture over here and here. And then you can see a little bit more of the fire furniture. And then you can see this really, really cool looking well. I love the style of it. That's so cool. So I just found this tweet that I really wanted to show you all just before we end this video. And so it was made by Kate Cart, too, too, one of the Royal High developers. And it says, in an attempt to get ahead and have all the winter stories ready on December the 1st, I'll post a winter story contest link on November the 13th. So, 13 days from when I'm recording this. The time is still TBD. I think that means it's unknown. But responding to a recent request that was sent, I'll do one time slot for the West and one time slot for the East. 100 slots each, 200 totals. There'll be 200 slots for you to be able to submit your story to make maybe have it in the fountain which is really really exciting obviously at the moment it's unknown like how many stories is actually going to be but I still think it's interesting to know that there's definitely going to be a winter halo 2020 well I imagine most of you probably guessed that already but at least now we know for sure you know Kika also said that it's unknown if it's going to be a winter wing contest because any contest would have to be cleared with Barbie first she's currently focused on new school but maybe once it's posted I can ask and see for now it appears like a no and then you can see another tweet here that was made by bongo lad saying wait so is there not going to be a fall halo slash autumn just wondering and keiko said no i was told not to this year the next one will be winter so that is the end of the video let me know if you all are excited for this new dorm furniture and of course the new cafeteria inside of a new Royal high school as well as the new hairstyles and the sky map and whatever other maps could possibly be coming for battle elora by the way apparently there's going to be like no halloween update i mean as i'm recording this it's literally halloween so I imagine you guys have probably guessed that already happy halloween and um, whatever <laughs> but yeah i don't know if the Halloween map that was made is going to be coming out then maybe it will come out but like it won't be labeled as Halloween it'll be labeled as something else like the pumpkins will be removed and it'll just be like a dark map or something I don't know but anyways that is the end of the video make sure you ring the bell to be notified do you like and subscribe and thanks for watching I hope you enjoyed